Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you uh, for the week. Let's see what's going on for you. Thank you God for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so we're going to pull one card for love and one for career. All right, love, Knight of Pentacles. All right, and then career. Okay, so the judgment card, rebirth with the Queen of Wands showing up. All right, so let's see what's going on for the Aquarius. So there could be a complete change, alteration in your career. Um, there could have been an ending in a love relationship and somebody's still stuck on you. Not making any move, but stuck here. Still devoted, committed to a relationship that doesn't even exist right now. Some of you are going to have a... Um, you're answering the call in terms of maybe career and finance to go it out, go it alone, do your own thing. Um, start something new, sever the tie, stop holding on to old loyalties in terms of the business that you've been at for 20 years or you're not sure if you can do it or if you can make this change, you're older, you're this, you're that. The universe is saying, look, this is what you say you want it. We put you in line to actually have it. So take the opportunity. The Queen of Wands talks about life purpose also. So some of you are coming into understanding your life purpose, coming into um, maybe presenting yourself to the world, putting something out there, being charismatic, courageous you know, to start your own thing. Um, it could have something to do with abilities your uh, intuitive psychic abilities, um, you being able to manifest or put things together, you being an entrepreneur, or maybe you're gonna help other people. There's gonna be a revival, a rebirth here. Scorpio coming up heavy for you. Scorpio could be in your chart. Look and see where it is in your astrological chart. There's an opportunity to have some fertility some growth, prosperity, but it's going to be by your own hand and it's going to be by having confidence and putting yourself out there and presenting what you offer to the world. That's the only way that you're going to have this abundance. It doesn't look like it's going to come by way of you working a job. All right, let's see what's going on. Yeah, make a smart decision. You got smart coming up. Um, you got crazy. Some People could think that you're crazy. You've got crazy big aspirations or prayers that you put out to the universe. Of course, you're, you're a good manifester with the Queen of Wands coming out. You could be a mom. You could be a working mom. You get a lot done. This is like the soccer mom who has a lot on her plate, but she gets it all done. Multitask. Friends could be significant. You could be beauty. You could use your beauty to actually have this financial abundance that either you already have or that you're embarking on. Uh, magic that's what I'm talking about Queen of Wands all about magic manifesting putting things out there helping the energy to shift to change to manipulate the energy could have your own business or you're wanting to start your own business uh, closure maybe to one cycle to go into the next but this is believing in yourself message maybe this message will help you move into that energy okay the Knight of Pentacles in love it looks like of course um, somebody's stuck there Dedicated, devoted to, but not doing anything. You could be dealing with Taurus, Virgo, Gemini, uh, Aries. Um, somebody who needs to start something or somebody who started something with you, but there was like failure to hold it together, to keep it together, to um, see it through. They couldn't maintain a relationship. You could have walked away, checked out, or this other person did, but it caused for whoever got left to be stuck now. Stuck in the energy of maybe wanting the relationship back, wanting to be committed, devoted. Um, the relationship for some of you, if you're already in one or a marriage, has grown cold, stale, boring. It says put some fun, inject some fun back into the relationship. It's just like you both are standing still. And it could be that this could be a temporary break between you and someone and then you could come back together. But things are going to be completely changed. It also says you can have complete change in your career and your finances. If you choose to put yourself out there, close out one cycle, go to the next, sever the ties with the old um, 
Quit holding on to old loyalties. Could be in love and career. This is what I have for you, Aquarius. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book your reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off at checkout. Um, Aquarius, that's all I have for you. Take care. Many blessings.